All right, what's up everybody tonight at the Pokemon Factory Network? Um, I'm going to be your host tonight. My name is Blade, and we're going to be doing a new deck tech for a deck I just finished putting uh, together today. I want to give a shout out to Purple Cliff, another YouTube channeler. I watched his video today and got the basis idea, but some of the cards in there were banned at this point. The, um, the reset stamps were banned, so I had to improvise and replace those, and I chose to replace those with two of Brock's grip. But anyway, enough talking. Let's go ahead and get jump into this deck and check it out. This is a um a low budget Raichu deck, and it mainly focuses around yeah, a powerful spark. It does 20 damage times the amount of electric energy that you have attached to all your Pokemon. Not just him, but to every Pokemon, including Pokemon on your bench. Now, for Pokemon in this deck, we're running Pichu or Pikachu. Everything is everything has the nuzzle attack, and that all goes based around our Emolga here, with this ability Nuzzle Gathering. Once during your turn before your attack, you may search your deck for a Pokemon that has a nuzzle attack. Reveal it and put it into your hand, then shuffle your deck. Now, what you mainly want to do is this deck wants to go on turn two so if you win the coin toss you go turn two let your opponent go second because you want to be able to attack the first turn now what you'll do is you'll start out with the mulga if he's in your open hand he has a retreat cost of zero so it works out pretty for, uh, pretty good for you what you want to do on your first turn you want to uh, lay out a mulga do the nuzzly gathering search for another mulga over and over again until you have all four Mogas out and then you also want to search for um, your Pachirisu. Pachirisu here with its uh, Snuggly Generator attack for each of your bench Pokemon that has the Nuzzle attack search your deck for a Lightning Energy and attach it to that Pokemon then shuffle your deck. Now that's where the, um, the damaging effect is going to come in for your Raichu. You want to have him out as your active Pokemon to gather, pretty much draw out all the electric energy that you have in your deck. And it doesn't necessarily, you don't want everything attached to Raichu because you don't want to lose everything. You only need one electric energy attached to him to get everything set off. But we also have a, um, a Tapu Koko here. Its ability is once during your turn before you attack, if this Pokemon is on your bench, you may choose two of your bench Pokemon and attach an energy card from your discard pile to each of them. If you do, discard all cards from your Pokemon and put it in the Lost Zone. Alright, let's get into the trainer cards. The trainer cards are running four Pokemon communications. It reveals a Pokemon from your hand, put it into your deck, and then if you do so, you may search your deck for a Pokemon. Reveal it and put it into your hand, then shuffle your deck. We're also running Quick Balls. You can play this card if you discard another card from your hand. Search your deck for a basic Pokemon. Reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your deck. We're running two great, cap or two great Catchers. You may play this card only if you discard two other cards from your hand. You can switch one of your opponent's Bench Pokemon GX or EX Pokemon with their active Pokemon. And that's what's going to help you gain up to two to three... Um, prize cards. If you're able to take out one of their EX cards, you'll gain two. If you take out a GX Mon, you'll gain three. We have one ordinary rod. Choose one or both. Shuffle up to two Pokemon from your discard pile into your deck. And then also shuffle up to two basic energy cards from your discard pile into your deck. Uh, we're also running four Electro Powers. This is during your turn, your electric Pokemon attacks do 30 more damage to your opponent's Pokemon. Shrine of Punishment. Between tu er, two, we're running two Shrine of Punishments. Between turns, put one damage counter on each Pokemon GX and or EX Pokemon. And then we also have the Golden version of it. We're running four Valkners. Search your deck for an item card and an electric energy card. Reveal them and put them into your hand, then shuffle your deck. And three Cynthias. Shuffle your deck into your hand, or er, shuffle your hand into your deck, then draw six cards. And then we're running four Professor's Research. You discard your hand and draw seven cards. And then we're running two Brock's Grip. Shuffle six a combination of any Pokemon and or basic energies from your discard pile back into your deck. And then the, for the last, we have three Lucky Eggs. 
The Pokemon this card is attached to is knocked out by damage from an opponent's attack. Draw cards until you have seven cards in your hand. And for our energies, we're just running 14 basic lightning energies. Alright, so we're going to back out of here. And we're going to get started into some matches. Alright guys, let's go ahead and get into our first batch here. Alright, with coin flips, like I said, you want to try to go second. Alright, we have an Amolga in our opening hand. So we'll go ahead and start with that as our basic. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. I haven't uh, been feeling a little under the weather the past couple days. But don't worry guys, I am completely clean of the corona. This pandemic has not been able to affect me just yet other than standard, difficult to work, yada yada, all that. Enough of that. Back to the game. Alright, so let's see. They started out with a glory and farfetch and with rots in the back. Alright, well, we'll go ahead and just start out with a quick ball, discard one of our communications, we're going to go for a Pachirisu, go ahead and get one of those out. And let's go ahead and just throw Pachirisu out in the front, attach one energy to him, and let's start running through this deck. Nuzzle gather, search for an Emolga. Once again, another Nuzzle Gathering, searching for a second or a third Amolga. <laughs> and finally, we're going to Nuzzle Gather once more and search for our fourth Amolga. And then one last time, we're going to search for our Pikachu. We'll put our Pikachu out on the field. Attach our lucky egg to Pachirisu. And we're just going to go ahead and discard those two and redraw our hand. Snuggly Generator. And draw in our energies. With that, we're going to pass our turn. Alright guys, remember that if um if you like what you see, if you like the content of um our channel, this channel is ran by me and several other people. And if um if you like our content, please like, subscribe, share, try to help us get our videos out there. Um we're also running a giveaway post on our um our Facebook group to everybody that subscribes. I mean, of course, you're going to have to be a member of the Facebook group to actually be able to show this. But to everybody that likes and sub or that subscribes to the YouTube channel, you will be you will receive a um, shiny battle ready Mew that will be distributed by all the admins and moderators of the Facebook group, including myself. <clears throat> And we're also doing a um, new member giveaway on Zarud and the Celebi events. So yeah, if that sounds interesting to you, you should uh, join up on our Facebook group and come check all that out. We are the um, Pokemon Battle Factory 
worldwide. Trades in world trades worldwide. Right now we're just trying to pretty much get all the cards out of our deck so we can draw through our our trainer cards. We should be able to do enough damage. I'm gonna go ahead and throw out our Raichu. Get him with the first powerful card. Look at that. 120 damage and we're only up to one, two, three, four, five, six, six energies. And with still four in the four in hand, couple in the graveyard that we're gonna be able to draw back out whenever we can draw our Brock script or our ordinary rod. Risu. Let's see. And, oh, let's just go ahead and continue pulling from the deck. We should be able to get the last of our cards out of here now on this turn. Or maybe not. We we'll still have one left. Turn, we'll have the last of our cards out. So now the only thing we're going to be drawing left are just our trainer cards and our item cards. <laughs> and not missing me enough here. Take our second prize card. Alright, so they're going to be throwing out uh, Golette. Let's see if they'll be able to make any kind of recovery or come back from this. Nope, and they just quit on us. Alright, that was a good match. Alright guys, we'll see you in just a second in our second match. Alright, welcome back everybody in our second match of this Raichu Budget Deck Preview. We have a Jurek B. Right, they chose to go first, and that works out in our favor. Right. We can start out with Pachirisu, and then whenever we start our turn, we can be able to use Quick Ball to draw out our Emolga, and then we'll just start our process all over again. We'll end that. Alright, uh, Dene GX. Right. Let's see what we can do against this deck. <clears throat> Hopefully this match goes just as smooth as the last one. Energy here to Pachirisu. Activate our Quick Ball. And discard one of our professor's research. Grab our Emolga. <coughs> Throw him out. And by this point, you should know the drill. Emolga searches for Emolga. <coughs> and Emolga searches for another Emolga. Searching for a Pikachu. Okay, Pikachu on the field. And sn 
an ugly generator. One of the Alright, that's gonna be the end of our turn. Sorry about disappearing like that for a second. It it took just some, it took a little bit for that our third opponent to get in here with us. All right, uh, no, we're going to do a second. <coughs> right, no basics in hand. So we're going to take a mulligan. Cynthia and see if we can draw into one. Right, no top deck. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this energy on the top three soon. Actually, I'm just gonna go ahead and just go with the Pokemon communication. Reveal him. Throw Petrusu back in. Search for a Molga. And the chaos begins. Oh no, was that the only other Amoga left in my deck? Must mean the other two are prize cards. Uh, that'd be alright. Let's go ahead and grab another Pikachu. Throw him onto the board. Activate another Cynthia. No other basics, but we do have a Shrine. Go ahead and throw that out. And we'll just go ahead and activate Snowly. Draw what we can. Energy and pass our turn. That sucks having two or our other two over here in the prize card section. Hopefully we can get him out of there pretty quick. I should be able to get out a decent amount of energy before he's able to take down this Pachirisu. Hopefully. Hopefully at least enough energy to be able to take down... Ooh. That's a big boy. Good, we're resistant to him. Right, I'm gonna go ahead and attach another energy to the Amolga here. And search for a Raichu. And go ahead and evolve our Pikachu. And search once more. And let's go ahead and just grab no, no. We wanna fill up our board. Grab a Pikachu. Go for another Snuggly Generator. And grab the rest of our energies out of the deck. And attach away.
No, let's go ahead and throw out this Pikachu. So in case we lose it, we don't lose too much of our um too much of our energies. So let's just go ahead and throw this Pachirisu out there. Attach the energy to him. Search for another Raichu. Five, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 200, 220, he has 230, let's go ahead and activate this, not the one that I wanted to switch out, but it'll be It's just the tag team cards that give you three. haven't drawn out one of our emojis yet. Hmm, throw out the Relodon. They're just going to attack me one time, take out my Raichu. I'm going to get two cards off of it. Or not. That's right. He is resistant to steel. Alrighty. Let's just go ahead and go in with uh, another powerful spell. Alright, so if we lose our Raichu, we can guarantee to keep our damage at 240 with this energy card right here. Okay. We're gonna lose Raichu here, but that is perfectly fine. We have two more in the back. And they are just as capable. Should be enough to knock him out. Perfect. And that's our last two cross cards. Alright, that's going be our third victory for the night. I hope you guys enjoyed the content. I said if you did, please like, subscribe, uh, turn on that bell notification to be notified when any and every other video is available to be watched. I have a booster pack opening for PTCGO that is going to be out on Thursday, so come and check that out as well. 
we'll be opening it up 50 plus um rebel clash packs and then we have some other booster packs as well that we were going to be opening yeah just uh come check us out like i said come check us out on facebook the pokemon factory battle and trade worldwide um come join us all new members will receive zarud and celebi from the new event movie and also if you like and subscribe to our channel you go in there and you um you find or you post your youtube username so we'll be able to match it to all subscriptions and once we do that we will be able to hand you out your battle ready shiny mew all right but that's going to be um it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed what you saw like subscribe once again please and um yeah we'll see you in the next video you guys have a good one